Okay, good morning, Finding Normal. This was my Valentine's Day gift. There are 50 fruit tree starts here. We have mulberry, figs, grapes, passion fruit, Okinawa spinach, and longevity spinach. I think that's all. There's two different types of grapes. And we're going to just get these little tiny transplants into these little tiny buckets right here. Little tiny starter containers. So we'll just upsize them to these little pots. And then I will um, upsize them in maybe a month to a much bigger one gallon. And we're just going to fill all these trays with the little pots and there's about 50 trees. So I went ahead and just mixed up some cow manure and organic compost from Walmart, threw in some perlite and a little bit of bone meal for some nutrition and stirred that all together here, make it look nice. And I've got a row of longevity spinach, Okinawa spinach, and I'm going to be starting on these little tiny mulberry trees. These are ever-bearing mulberries. So those will be fun to watch grow up. Okay, that's what 50 little fruit trees and spinach looks like. I've got, um, over here is the mulberries, a four rows, two, three, four rows of that. And this is the longevity spinach and the Okinawa spinach. These are the grapevines. Actually, no, those are the figs. And these are the grapevines. So I'm going to get these little babies watered and have them sitting out in the sun and I'll keep them in these pot pots maybe like a month and then we'll go ahead and, and pot them into the one gallons. Um, I didn't pot them into the one gallons to begin with because we're gonna it seems like we might have a few cold nights and in these uh, milk trays with these little pots they're just easy to move around uh, put them where I need them while they're still young uh, tender plants and they they still have plenty of room to grow in these uh, little pots their roots still have plenty of room so they can easily go another month in that so that's it thanks for watching bye